everybody, Backyard Bullion here, and today I am joined at the kitchen table by the wonderful Mrs. Backyard Bullion. Hello. And we have some good and bad news to share with you all. First off though, don't worry too much, the bad news is nothing catastrophic. The good news first though, Backyard Bullion as a business, as a brand, has continued to grow strength to strength this last year, and 2018 into this first three months of 2019 have been massively more mad and bonkers and that's only down to all of you out there for supporting us. With that success though comes uh, the attention of the tax man and any business that starts to ramp up and do very well has to in the UK register for sales tax VAT. The very thing that I've been on my channel so many times saying that we need to avoid with European group orders we now as a business have to register to charge VAT to our customers in the UK and EU. Now that is going to affect pricing for our products. There's no way about it. Uh, it's something that we've been thinking about for this last couple of weeks now. Uh, and it's you know, something I've lost quite a lot of sleep over and worried about. Mrs. Backyard Bullion's done a bit of a better job coping with it than I have, haven't you? Yes. <laughs> but. Ultimately, the decision that we've made is that, um, you know, it's a good thing that we've registered for VAT. It means that uh, the business well, we is... Had, we had to. Well, we had it to. It wasn't really a choice. No, that's very true. <laughs> uh, but ultimately, we're going to see this as a good thing. We've been through different barriers in the past. The adoption of hallmarking on all of the handful of silver was the biggest one that we faced about two years ago. And now this is another little barrier for us to get through. But there's a lot of really good positives in the future for us, for the company. And we'll talk about those a little later. But what it means for you guys is that you will notice um, price increases on some of our well, some of our products that aren't VAT exempt. Pretty much all of our products, unfortunately. Now, we've taken the decision to increase the prices across the board uh, to help mitigate the fact that if we just lumped a full 20% whack on everything, it would be quite a big increase for everybody. So, you won't see a big 20% increase, but there will be an increase, which is of course. Uh, you know, price increases are always never good, but at the same time, we are looking to this for the future as to how we can manage it best for our business, for what we want to achieve with the business. And on that front, I think it's really important to emphasize that the product won't change. The product will be, if anything, as high a quality as it's ever been. It will be even higher quality if possible. We want to make sure that the items we produce and the service that we provide is the best, and it will be as good as it can be and will be forever, basically. That's the most important thing about our brand. So that's kind of the message that we want to share with you guys here today. That, and it'll still be us. And it'll still us. be us, yeah. And you know, whilst the business is growing, we have no desire at all to start employing people and getting no more. No plans. No plans whatsoever. <laughs> Looking after you is enough. Thank you. Well, <laughs> you, you do. Well, I, I already have one employee, so to speak, and that's Mrs. Backyard Bullion. She doesn't get paid. <laughs> In takeaway. You get paid in a takeaway every now and again, but um, yeah, it's, you know, we don't want to go and hire anybody. We don't want to ramp this up to be a multi-million pound business or anything silly like that. So, and we I think that's also... We we enjoy it. Yeah. We do it because we love it and it's something that I'm passionate about, something that you've become yeah. a lot more passionate about since the first day I turned to you. It's taught us lots of skills. It has. But you've, it's amazing how you've even become more passionate about this, considering the look you gave me when I first told you I want to buy a furnace and melt silver. Well, the quality of takeaways have got better. <laughs> the quality of takeaways have got better, so there you go. So, yes, bad news in that sense, but really good news that you guys out there are still supporting us and still supporting the brand and the silver. And the fact that we want to keep that quality high and the, you know, things like the mintage is low, make sure we keep the product as high a quality as possible is really important for the brand and for us in the future. And I think that's the message that we want to put here that we are committed to that quality, low mintage, you know, premium products that we produce already. And to that end, we've got some brand new pieces out here on the table. We've got the 100 gram BYB bars that are available on my website now. And we've also got some brand new pieces which will be showcased after this video, a bit later today in a silver pouring compilation. So you can see some molten silver uh, being poured and these individual pieces, loads of really cool ones here, Celtic rounds and things like that. So stick around and catch that video later. The last thing we want to finish on here today is uh, a huge thank you to all of you guys out there. Without you, it really wouldn't have been possible to even get to this stage. I think it's also really important to say to you guys that 
we will be keeping a very careful eye on how things progress over the next you know three months six months year uh, it's a lot of new things for us to take on board in admin and learning about VAT and everything and we will be reassessing uh, you know as we go throughout this next 12 months the impact it has on us the business but you the customer as well so we are aware of a lot of the different things I think is what we're trying to say yeah there's lots of different variables but we'll just continue just to see how things go for now yeah it doesn't mean that we will be stopping making fun videos here on YouTube that's a whole separate part of the business so you guys will continue to see cool unboxings showcasings of coins and various things like that as well now if so you guys it all depend on Brexit well, a little bit, I suppose, but we can still pick up and showcase coins here and yeah. there. And I guess unboxings is a little bit up in the air with Brexit yeah, as well. I was just referring to the group orders. But... Yes. But, yeah, uh, let's not get into Brexit. That's no. a whole kettle of fish. But, yes, we will endeavour to bring you all fun videos in the future. Now, if you guys have any questions about this uh, good and bad news that we've put here today, please feel free to comment down in the comment section with your questions. We will be replying to each and every one that we can. And if you want to keep that a private question, then please feel free to email me as well. There's an email uh, address down in, the, uh, d down in the description section where you can drop an email straight through to us and get in touch. Thank you, though, for all of your support. If you enjoyed this video, if you enjoyed Backyard Bullion, just put a thumbs up on this video because that helps everything that we do here on YouTube. If you want to see more videos from us in the future and get updates on our hand pulled silver, our business and everything that we're doing, hit the subscribe button. And if you want to get a notification when those videos go live, hit the alarm bell. Otherwise, stick around for the silver pouring compilation coming out in a few hours. Have a fantastic week ahead, guys. Thank you one and all for watching. And please make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe for more. Bye-bye.